My name is Odwa Fuchane. I'm from Langa Township. Um, by profession, I'm a tour guide, um, but my passion lies in the townships. And uh, through my tour experience, I offer home visits. And uh, in these home visits, um, I got to notice that there's lots of inequality, unemployment, um, poverty, and uh, I always try to influence uh, my international guests to help where they can. Um, but because of COVID-19, um, I haven't been able to. Um, however, I want to give lots of thanks um, to, to Dion, um, to Eugene, um, the rest of the church, and everyone that has been involved with the donations of clothing um, and food parcels. Uh, they've, they've reached lots of families, um, people have been showing lots of gratitude, um, you know, they've been putting lots of smiles to different families, um, that's, that's thanks to you. And uh, the families I've been um, contributing to um, are those living in informal settlements, um, those living in um, temporary housing um, and those living in, in, in different hostels. Okay, so over here we have some of the single-sex hostels. Obviously today we have um, different families accommodating, accommodated inside. So in each room you'll have um, two, three families accommodated. So here we have two families um, accommodated um, and this lady with two of her kids, she sleeps on the bed on the other side, um, but she's one of the people I've contributed to. Okay, so uh, these are some of the temporals um, I contribute the food parcels and the clothing to. Um, each container basically accommodates two families. And these are not the only ones. If you look across the road on the other side, um, the informal houses, those are part of, part of temporary housing. So here we have Vukanom Topoi Orphanage Home, um, which caters for about 26 kids all together. Um, different ages from toddler to, to adult and uh, it is all thanks to this lady um, Namute Patricia Fuchani so she is the person uh, that started the orphanage um, so she is also one of the people I contribute with the food parcels so uh, the way it works is um, every Mondays I would meet either Eugene or another leader um, in Pinelands, I believe, in Civic Centre. Um, so I would hire a vehicle, um, usually a taxi, and then I would go to Pinelands to collect um, the food parcels as well as the clothes. And then um, I would bring them to where I'm staying. Um, I stay in, in, in the hostels still, so we have a big living room. Um, so I would put everything there um, and then I would go and select the different families uh, because if I distribute um, publicly that might create problems because other people will complain that they don't get and there will be other questions too. So to avoid that from happening, um, it's better that I do it um, in a closed space. So I would usually take 12, 15 um, people or families um, and then I'll take different um, people for the following week. Thank you. Will you be able to Project Patesta is on the beach to bring costpakjes, clothes, shoes, gefrieste soap and converse 
te gee aan behoeftige gemeenschappen in ons areas. Jij kan op maandag, dinsdag en vrijdag tussen 8 uur en 12 uur hier de items bij de kerk afgeven. Dank je dat je bij ons ingeschakeld hebt voor de Eredienst. Ons zien je weer volgende week.